Hello everyone, I am Kimaya and I am back with another video. And yes, I do remember my promise. So as I promised in the previous video, this video is going to be completely based on the activities. Today we will be performing three different activities and they are very interesting and they are going to help us in maintaining brain to body movement contact. So they are kind of brain boosting activities. So let us start with the first one. So guys, in this first activity, we are going to create a diamond like shape like this by using a simple thread. So let us start to perform this activity. I have used a very simple thread like this. I'll pass this thread across my palm like this and same thing I'll do with my other hand. So the first step is done. Now I'll be using my index fingers to pull the threads towards the other hand. Okay, I'll pull it like this. Same thing I'll do with the right hand. I'll pull the thread from the right hand towards the left hand. Okay, so this kind of structure is getting formed. Now, I'm going to release my thumbs from the loop. Now, the X-like structure is ready. Next step is crucial. I'm going to take the loop from right hand index finger out like this. And I'll give it a twist. One and two. So I have given it a two times twist and that two towards my side. I'll perform the same activity with the little finger. Take the loop out, give it a twist two times and that's it. This step is done. Now I'll take the thumbs. I'm going to use my thumbs and I'll be taking the last thread facing the viewers towards my side. So I'm just going to push my thumb below the thread and I'm going to pull it towards me. Okay. Now, the next step is important. I'm going to stretch a loop which is on the index finger towards the thumb and I'm going to place it across the thumb. I will take the lower loop of the thumb out and place it across the palm. Same activity I'll perform with the right hand. Stretch the loop from the index finger towards the thumb. Take the lower loop of the thumb out and place it across the palm. Now, as you could see, two small triangular structures are present over here. I'm going to put my index fingers into the triangles. Okay. Now, the next step is to release the little fingers from the loop. And now we have reached to the last stage. Just stretch the hand towards the viewer and the diamond structure is ready. So give it a try and let me know how it turns out. Guys, in the second activity, this activity is based on synchronization of brain, eye and hand movement contact. So activity is very simple and it's a single step activity, but a tricky one. Okay, so a first step is like this. We are going to perform the same step again and again in continuous manner like this. Though it appears very simple, it can be tough to especially children. So just give it a try and see if you could do it successfully for at least 20 times. Okay, so guys, the third activity is very much similar to the second activity, but more difficult than the second one. And it is tricky again. So let us see how we are going to perform. Clap. Right hand towards the left ear. Clap. Left hand towards the right ear. So we are going to do this activity in continuous manner like this. So this is it. Now your task is to try this activity at least 10 times in continuous manner without a break. Okay. So just give it a try to all these activities and let me know the fun you had and the experience that you would like to share with me. So this is it for today. Take care and see you all in the next video, which is about the birds. Okay. But 
Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel. Bye-bye.